Hey everybody, welcome back to the Coin Pusher. Today we're doing a five million dollar buy-in. They gave us five quarters for five million dollars. We're putting them over here on this left side. Hopefully we'll get us a nice push. Oh, we got, what, one quarter back? We got one quarter left. Let's put it in. Oh wow, that pushed extremely well. We got a whole handful of quarters now. Let's see, probably the left side's probably still pretty good. Let's keep putting them on the left. Oh nice, some on the right even moved. Oh yeah. They got this thing loaded up really well. There is a humongous wall in there. Made out of $10,000 chips. There's, uh, what, three golden towers just in front of it. Uh, each one of them is holding up a mystery bag. Which hopefully there's some really nice stuff in the mystery bags. Some super expensive stuff. Oh my goodness, the tower back. There's a tower behind this wall. It's, it's falling apart. Gave us a nice little push right here. Oh yeah, you can see it back there through that gap. Oh yeah, it's knocking it all down. Keep her going. Sweet. Come on, you can do it. Go on, Oh, We're about to get a whole bunch of gold. We're making a ton on, on $10,000 chips. Just got a mystery bag. Nice. Oh, yeah. It's raining five and $10,000 chips. Wow, they got this thing loaded up nice, don't they? Get ready to go. Power back there. Oh, nice. There it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. Sweet, baby. Nice. This keeps on going. It's doing so well. Oh, yeah. Wow, just one good push after the next. This is doing so good. Oh, check it out. There's a mystery bag right there. The golden one. I'm not even sure that was where that one came from. No, it it might have been hidden inside of that great big tower. That might have been what it was. I didn't see anything. No golden mystery bag. I looked down inside that big tower, it had a bunch of quarters in it, so it's probably hidden under the quarters. It's doing really well. I haven't actually tallied anything up yet, so I'm not sure how we're actually doing, but we're probably doing pretty well. I've just been uh, grabbing the quarters. And then getting right back to it. Oh yeah, nice. That was a good one. Paid out in five and ten thousand dollar chips. Okay, rain in five thousand dollar chips for the next couple of minutes, probably. It's a whole bunch on them red shelves. There's what? Uh, one, two, four mystery bags. And six towers way in the back that are made out of $25,000 chips. Each one of those chips back there is $25,000 each. And then uh, that big wall kind of separated into sections and. and uh, Left some of it up against here and over here. So it's like two pyramid looking uh, towers on them red shelves made out of $10,000 chips. And of course there's a whole bunch of $5,000 chips back here. I think that was the, the tower that was back here. I think when it exploded it fell onto the uh, wall. Bunch of them red shelves. Tell you what, that golden tower on the left corner, it has moved forward a bunch. A whole bunch. A 
Hopefully we'll be getting that here soon. You know what, let's check out these mystery bags, see how we're doing on them. Oh sweet, we got one of the golden dice and one of the white dice. Let's check out the other mystery bag, see how that one is. Oh sweet, we got something in there. Oh nice, one more of the white dice and the green reset chip. Sweet. So this here will get us uh, everything that's on the red shelves and they'll reset the machine. Like this over here is touching the glass, not the glass but the wall. So they'll move that as well. Uh, I think it's probably good uh, good enough time to go ahead and turn this in. Let's keep it going. Hopefully this does really well. They built them pretty tall though, so we'll see. Let's see how it goes. So what, one, two, three, four mystery bags? Oh my goodness, the first tire fell over. Landed right on the red shelf. Oh, the second one fell over. It did just perfect. I know they're kind of hard to see on the camera because of these uh, these tires right here are totally blocking everything. Oh my, there went two more. Oh, timber! Oh my goodness. That was a good one. Fell straight into the pay. We got some of that one as it fell down. Oh yeah, taking them all down, ain't we? Let's get this last tower. I guess there's two towers there, actually. There's a golden tower just behind that one. Oh my, it's gonna push right on into the pay, isn't it? Oh, so is the mystery bag. Oh yeah, sweet, baby, sweet. I'll take that. Oh yeah, we're gonna get another mystery bag over on that left side. The pink one. About to get the uh, golden tower. It's gonna be raining gold here soon. I guess it already is over there on that left side, isn't it? Oh, it's so close. Just about went, didn't it? Oh my goodness, there went that golden tower. Done falling over. Landed on the red shelf. There's a mystery bag stuck in there. Oh, sweet, it just slid on down. Let's say there's a mystery bag stuck down there in the loot chute. It broke free. We did lose quite a bit to the red shelves. Uh, we can get all that back for $10,000. Of course, we got, what, four mystery bags? We gotta check through those. There's a potential that we might get something in there that'll get us a, a free reset. I guess I forgot to mention what the white dice and the golden dice were for the, for the new new viewers. Now, later on, we're gonna roll those and dice, and they're gonna be multipliers. The white dice will be a multipliers for the poker chips, and if there was any cash in here. And the golden dice will be multipliers for the gold. So it's pretty important to uh, get some dice and to get some nice numbers on them. And we've pulled a pretty decent amount out of here. So we should be setting pretty, pretty good.
Oh, yeah. Should be raining $25,000 chips. Oh, indeed. Nice. $10,000 chips as well, and, and gold bars. Wow, indeed, it is doing a marvelous. Alrighty, let's check out these other mystery bags, see how we did on them. Oh, sweet, we got the gutter chip game. That's amazing right there. That'll get us everything that is falling down in that hole right there and that hole right there. And there's also one down in there too. So that's pretty sweet, as well as a white dice. Uh, I'll find that gutter chip here in a moment. One of these bags had fallen open. Maybe, oh, it's this pink one here. This pink one's completely empty. But uh, that right there was sitting in my hand. So we got an extra white dice and a thousand free quarters headed our way. So we'll turn that in and we'll get a thousand free quarters. That is awesome. Put that up there. Let's check this out. Oh, sweet. One more white dice and one more golden dice. They're adding up. Each one of them is worth a ton. Oh, sweet. Two more white dice. Oh, and this right here gets us a free tower made out of $10,000 chips right there. That's what that says. That is amazing. I say we go ahead, turn in the uh, free 1,000 quarter chip, and get us 1,000 extra quarters. Um, yeah, let's do that. And then uh, we'll try to get as much of this as we can out of there. All right, so we're back at it. We turned in the uh, blue um, chip that got us an extra thousand quarters. Let's try to get as much of this out of here as we can. At least the, the stuff that pushes out pretty easily anyway. I don't want to push too many quarters in the gutter. However, that one looks like it's clogged up, doesn't it? Probably can't lose nothing to that gutter, which is okay with me. We do got the gutter chip. I know I keep saying gutter, but we did have to get a chip. Pretty nice. But we'll turn in the uh, free $10,000 tower here soon. They'll build us uh, a tower made out of $10,000 chips. It'll be anywhere between one chip and all the way up to as many as they can fit in there. And anywhere in between. We literally turned it in and only got one chip it was it was a sad day but uh, most of the time that's not the case almost never I don't know how they come up with how many they're supposed to put in there but uh, we've been doing pretty good on them for the most part uh, that's probably good enough what do you think Pro yeah I, I, probably not worth wasting the quarters to get that that, that we'll get that here in just a moment. Let's turn in the uh, oh, where's it at? Let's turn this in and get us a free tower made out of ten thousand dollar chips. That is amazing. All right, we'll be right back. Uh, I think I might have forgot to mention that the um, the free ten thousand dollar chip tower also gets you a free reset. So they take everything that's on them red shelves and move it. And they, I don't know. It was like an hour and a half ago when I said I was turning that in. I had to wait for them forever to get here. So maybe I did say something, I don't know. But if not, now you know. Oh, that tower is moving up real quick like. I'm trying to give it a nice even push. I don't want it uh, going to land on the shelves hoping it down it might though I mean, that's a really tall I really don't think I could make it much taller about looks like about five chips taller they could have made it of course some of that stuff is the stuff that was on the red shelves all the high price stuff is way up in the air it's kind of kind of worrisome but we do got the gutter chip that'll also get us a free reset so if we do lose it all we we can uh, Get it back one last time. Oh my, look at that. Three $10,000 chips are falling out of the base of that big old tower. Oh, 
Oh yeah, it's moving on up. Real quick like. Oh yeah. See, how did we do that that one day to get the uh we're gonna be going which way i was trying to think of how we could possibly get the top of that tower to fall forward ah yeah just like that nice i'm pressing the, the skill stop button it's a button that they have that is exactly for you to use your skills and push the skill stop button to uh, let you do stuff just like that. So that is that's the purpose of that button, and it's also so you can hold the button down and put uh, a whole bunch of quarters in one spot. It's got a lot of purposes. It's a skill stop button for a reason. It's it's there for us to use it if we want to. And I felt like we were really needed to that time. That was, I felt pretty important that that needed to be pressed. I didn't want all that stuff laying on the red shelves. It's just too much on the line, you know. I'm trying to push on this right side, because we do have uh, quite a bit of $25,000 chips trying to go in that right gutter. Quite often, if you push on the same side as the item that's trying to go in the gutter, you can push it on past. It doesn't always work out. And if it don't, it's not a huge deal. We do got the gutter chips, so. But it's nice to get it on out, uh, push it on past there and win it if we can. Just one less thing we gotta worry about. Trying to maximize our profits here. That's what it's all about. Having fun and having a good time and making some profits at the same time. I appreciate y'all tuning in, watching the videos, and especially those that watch it from the beginning all the way to the end. I greatly appreciate it. Leaving them like buttons and, and subscribing and uh, leaving comments is amazing stuff. So thank you so much. It's been a, a wonderful time following along with all of you. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have been a blast throughout the years. We're not going anywhere, so uh, don't, don't worry about that. I love what I do. However, I do got to stop and get some quarters, though. And in fact, uh, being that 125 grand, is that what that is? Yeah. I think we're going to go ahead and turn in the gutter ship. Alrighty, let's keep her going. Quite a bit of $25,000 chips. There's a humongous dollar sign mystery bag in there. I can see uh, four ounces of gold. Quite a bit of five and $10,000 chips as well. We are losing a little bit to that rat gutter as we speak. Just paying it forward to the next guy or gal. The way it rolls, it's gonna be just fine. Going for a jackpot win on this one. That mystery bag is looking pretty full. Hopefully it is. Sometimes they're just full of hot air. We'll see. Let's see how it turns out. It's moving along really well, so it shouldn't take us too long, I wouldn't think. Thirty-five grand on the pusher shelf. We didn't lose nothing to the red shelf beside a few quarters. That ain't no big deal. We have to get the mystery bag. Oh, I thought it was. Looks like it there, didn't it? There's what seventy-five grand on the right corner. Cha-ching! Nice. 
One of them gold bars. There's another one about to go. Oh yeah, and the mystery bag went as well. I don't know about you, but that kind of looked like it flattened out as it was falling. Hopefully. That's not the case. Hopefully. and check it out and see what's in that mystery bag then we'll know for sure oh my gosh that was way better than i thought four white dice wow that is gonna make for a massive jackpot win i'm hoping now we gotta roll the dice and we gotta land on some good numbers for it to really matter but it gives us four opportunities to get some good numbers If they do land on a one, then they are a loser and a losing dice. It's gotta be two or better. Still pretty good odds though. Of being a winner. So what, 85 grand in there? That's what I'm seeing anyhow. Let's get it. Let's get it all out of there. Then we'll get on to rolling them dice. Left side is struggling a little bit today. Hopefully they didn't change whatever they did a few weeks ago to make it so the left side is doing okay. Hopefully they didn't change it back. It's kind of looking that way, but it might just be a fluke, a fluke thing. I hadn't noticed it the rest of the game. Sixty grand over there though. Oh yeah, that's moving along doing all right oh yeah we just got 30 of it oh, sorry we got 35 of it twenty five grand to go the corners are always a little more difficult it's just the way it is it's always been that way Quarters that like to go where there's least resistance, easiest for it to flow through, and a lot of times that's the gutters. If you watch them, there's just quarters constantly going into the gutters, and then of course straight ahead, right up here, is is a pretty good spot for them to go. Also, they don't like to go that way, all the way over in that far corner. You gotta really persuade them. Just to kind of nudge it a little here and a little there until eventually it goes. And we're making some progress. It's gonna go here soon. Oh yeah, sweet, there it is. Technically it's stuck right there. But that is considered a win, but I'll, I'll probably go ahead and uh, Stick a couple of quarters in there till we get it. There we go, we got it. I'm gonna be calling back here, having placed some dice in there. Oh yeah, we got a six on the gold and a one on the white dice. The ones are unfortunately, I just said, are a complete loss. We you get a couple of sixes there and a four. Be all right. Oh my, there's some real good numbers right there. Oh, another one just went over to a one. I don't want to risk it and push it no more though. We might lose some of those really valuable sixes in there. So let me uh, tally it all together and we'll see how we did. All right, so all together we pulled $26,045,000 out of there. And then White Dice totaled it up to 41. Turned it into an astounding 1,067,000,000. Eight hundred and forty-five thousand dollars. 
That is absolutely incredible. I also pulled 33 ounces of gold out of there and them golden dice tilted up to 11. Turned it into 363 ounces of gold. All in all, that's not too bad for a $5.1 million buy-in. Not bad at all. Well, if y'all enjoy the videos, do me a favor, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and we'll see you on the next one. And feel free to press that share button if you'd like. Anyhow, we'll see you tomorrow. Y'all take care.